Dr. Brian, I'm going to send it over to you first. And, uh, you know, give us a, a sort of a, you know, what does it look like in a couple of years, you're two, two years further into the zero trust capability, enabling that across the, uh, uh, the department. Uh, what does that look like? What, what, what are you expecting at that point in time? Yeah, I think, um, you know, as we look out past this year and into the, you know, the three year horizon timeframe, I, I think we're really looking at integrating, um, you know, application or op opportunities for uh, increasing security through, you know, uh, uh, PEPs, um, looking at trying to get application level um, evaluation of security constraints, um, things like, you know, understanding the data that an application is sending across the wire. Um, really getting a lot more granular in how we're applying permissions, uh, utilizing those things that we've got in our zero trust stack. Um, you know, getting getting our data um, uh, getting our data defined uh, so we can better understand whether you know a certain request should be available to any user. Um, you know, understanding where that data is going, how it's being used. Um, you know, I think data is is definitely going to be that longer term uh, goal for us. Um, just because, you know, as we start to get our, our infrastructure and as we start to get our connectivity uh, a lot more secure, you know, we're just going to keep going down the stack, getting a little bit more granular, um, you know, and I think that ends up uh, really heavily in the data array and, uh, and really at the application level. 